So here is my uh, video of a new notebook uh, which comes from Italy and which is a Cangini Filippi with two P's. Uh, so that's a, an occasion I got on Amazon, uh, France. There was only one notebook from this uh, mark and I didn't know it so that was a good occasion to try. So what you get in terms of size, if you compare it to a um, Leuchtturm which is the same, si same size as a Moleskin, you've got a difference in on this side, same height. So basically what you get is the same size as you would get from a Moleskin hardcover collection version. That's exactly the same size on every side, right? So uh, because usually uh, the uh, collection Moleskine's hardcover are a bit smaller, a bit less large. It's a small A5. Let's say it's a small A5. Okay, so let's look at this. Uh, this one was uh, 15.95 euros and that was the only one available in France from this uh, Ange Cangini Filippi. And in terms of aspect, it um, the cover looks like it's paper. It looks like wood a bit, but it's green. And it has the touch of a, a bit of a touch of leather. And you've got embossed an embossed tree with metallic silver decorations, which is both nice and sober, discreet. You've got a green elastic band and on the side you've got a green pen holder and the little page mark is beige color and on the other side you've got this wood aspect which you see better on the side. So it's a uh, really beautiful cover. So let's have a look inside and see what's the paper, what's the paper like. Okay so here we've got the name and address cardboard and let's go to the middle. It lays flat completely, which is nice. From touching the paper, I would say it's a 90 gram paper. It's not 80 gram. It's not as thick as a 100 gram, so it must be 90 gram. I'm going to check that, but I'm quite sure just touching it with my fingers. It's a bit translucent and it's not shiny. It would be good enough for fountain pens, ballpoint pens, also for sketching, but it's rather smooth. So uh, sketching if you do not mind the smoothness, a smoothness which is good for fountain pens I guess. Um, but there might be a bit of, uh, of ghost marking on the other side, maybe. I, I do not use fountain pens so I wouldn't know. but. Maybe that would be, but it's a nice quality notebook. And at the end, you got a paper pouch which is very fragile. Okay. So, in conclusion, that's a quite definitely a quality notebook. Definitely worth its price in the same range as Moleskine or Leuchtturm. We have a nice discreet decoration which is the maximum that I want on my notebooks and that's a nice aspect it says quality, beauty, that's nice I like that in notebook. I'm going to look uh, at other products of them because it's a nice first experience with them I like that one. 